guys, so I thought I would do a grocery haul with a meal plan for you guys today, a little bonus video, not on my normal schedule. This is one that was requested on Insta Stories. I asked what kind of video requests you guys would wanna see, and someone specifically said a grocery haul with a meal plan, and I haven't been doing grocery hauls, but I thought with a meal plan, I can do that. So I'm gonna show you what was just delivered from Walmart. We have been doing our Walmart deliveries on Sunday morning. I've actually been using their delivery system for a, uh, a while now instead of doing their pickup. And the reason for that is just because it's so convenient. Um, I've been having them delivered on Sunday mornings right before we leave for church, like between 8 and 9 a.m. And that's been awesome. So we get our groceries put away, we leave for church, and we come home to like a fresh start for the week. I've been loving that. Um, I'm gonna put a code down if I can find one in the description box. If you guys wanna get $10 off of a Walmart order if you've never done one before, it's just a referral, co referral code. So it's one of those like, I think you get $10 and I get like $10 or something along those lines. So it's not an affiliate link or anything, but I, I think that I have a referral code. I've seen that before. So I'll put that down below if you guys are wanting to try out Walmart ordering or order pickup or delivery. Anywho, I'll show you what I got from Walmart and then I actually had to do a Publix pickup. Um, I had to swing through Publix because um, I needed a few things that only Publix has. So I'll show you this and then I will show you what I get from Publix later today. All right, so this is what we got from Walmart and I will put the total down here. Um, and then I'll also, well, I'll just put the full total here for Walmart and Publix because by the time I'm editing this, I should be able to figure that out. Um, and I'm going to put a link below to my blog post with our meal plan, everything from breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, all that jazz. You guys can see what we are having this week. So John did this organizing for me, which I really appreciate. I've got some of these. These chocolate chips are awesome. These melt down just the same as regular chocolate chips. These have only three ingredients, chocolate, cocoa butter, and cane sugar. Uh, I got two packs of these um, whole wheat tortillas. Got some croutons. I have a bunch of different flours here. I got some Bob's Red Mill gluten-free flour. I love this stuff. I seriously love this stuff. Then I got some organic all-purpose flour. This is because the kids are making non bread um, at their history co-op that I'm leading this week. So uh, I got some regular flour for that and then some whole wheat flour because I know I'm not gonna feel like milling any wheat for um, some meal prep this week. So I just got that. Um, I also have been using these Bob's Red Mill rolled oats. We've been really enjoying those. I got some organic cacao powder. These cinnamon roasted almonds are the bomb. I love them. Um, I got some brown rice spaghetti. You guys saw a couple weeks ago our meals of the week video. We made um, the, uh, the Asian noodle salad. So I'm gonna try it with this this week. I got some jasmine rice. This was Walmart's substitute for um, Annie's organic uh, uh, macaroni, which is what I was gonna make along with some chicken for the kids at co-op this week, but I'm sure they'll be thrilled that this, is, this was the substitute. That's why I like using Walmart's delivery because they will sub something and that just makes my life easier versus having to figure out what to do in place of something. I got these nut thins for myself, some Triscuits for the kiddos. Uh, these blue corn chips just for guac for the week, um, some paper towels, some toilet paper. Um, I got this Earth Balance butter. Um, I got some pimento cheese. We're gonna have my aunt over for some tea time for her birthday this week, and she loves pimento sandwiches, so I thought we'd make little tea sandwiches for her. I got some tofu, some organic tofu for the week. This is the ginger paste, because I'm gonna be making a lot of recipes that call for ginger in the next couple weeks. Uh, almond milk. This is the um, organic chicken strips. So this is for the co-op kids. Then I've got this for um, John and I and then for another meal this week. These, um, do you pronounce that Gardein or Garden? I'll put a poll up here. Let me know how you guys would pronounce that. Um, one of my girlfriends just raves about these. She said her kids love them. So I'm gonna give those a whirl. Some organic frozen broccoli. Um, what do we have over here? A couple cans of organic black beans. I think we have like four cans of organic chickpeas. Um, a couple cans of water chestnuts for a stir fry. A can of chopped green chilies. I've got some cornstarch back there. Um, then I've got four cans of light coconut milk. This is to make um, coconut rice. I love boiling our rice in coconut milk. Um, yeah, that's, that's all that, right? Okay. 
Um, then over here, I've got some onion powder, some um, raw honey, uh, some ranch for the kids' salad bar, six cans of the hum kombucha. This stuff is really good. Um, some chickpea pasta, two boxes of it. We've got two bags of broccoli slaw for that uh, noodle salad, two bags of organic apples, a couple bundles of asparagus, some bananas, some grape tomatoes. My kids love these cuties, so we've got that. Um, and then some organic potatoes, a bunch of lemons, um, a bunch of avocados. Oh, these are all, okay, a bunch of limes, some kale, uh, let's see, oh, radishes, yeah, some radishes, some red onion, some cilantro, a couple bunches of carrots here, some lazy mom carrots here for another recipe, um, some cucumbers, some organic green beans, a couple pints, and are these each a pint? I don't know, what are they? I don't know little clamshells, whatever they're called, of, um, I don't think that's a pint, of blueberries, some organic spinach, some organic spring mix, and then some organic celery. Did I cover all of it on this table? Yes, I believe so. So now I'll switch over to our Publix order. All right, so from Publix, I grabbed these um, different sauerkraut pouches. These are in the refrigerated vegetable section, you know, in the cooler with the um, it's, it was actually over by like the um, toe furky and all that. Um, so I got, I like to put sauerkraut on my salads um, and I didn't know which one to go for, but they were BOGO. So I got one of each. They are good until like November. So I thought I would just give them all a try. So I got the classic caraway nar nar. I'm not sure. This is the one that I wanted and then I only got one pouch because then I saw these other ones. Uh, roasted garlic and beet red. Uh, also these baby bell peppers were bogo so i got a couple of those um these were bogo as well so i got two uh, things of raspberries this is the milk that we swear by um, my daughter cannot have milk at all dairy at all so she loves this vanilla ripple milk this is what her gi doctor recommended because it's high in protein and it's not like drinking according to her doctor it's not like drinking water like almond milk would be um for her growing so she likes the ripple milk they only have it in our area they only have it at Publix and Target so every time I'm in Publix I grab some I also love this for lattes or for cooking any plant-based meals this is my favorite um, because it doesn't have a flavor like coconut milk does so for example you'll see in my meal plan I'm making um like a Cajun pasta it's very dairy heavy, and so if I were to use coconut milk, it would give it a sweet taste. The ripple milk is perfect for cooking and baking like that, so um, I got some of that. I got this, my kids rarely have juice, but because it was buy one get one, I grabbed some. I got two cans of the full fat coconut milk because they didn't um, have it in our Walmart order like you saw uh, a second ago in my video. Um, we had four cans of the reduced fat because they were out of the standard coconut milk and I'm making some coconut mousse this week. Um, I got an, uh, not an avocado, I got a, come on brain, artichoke. I got some Parmesan for that recipe I was talking about. I got some almond milk cream cheese for another recipe and then I got some raw cashews. So that is my Publix order and I will go ahead and reinsert my um, total from each store down here. This is for a week and then some, you know, some of this stuff is just for this week. Some of this stuff is just stock up style. Um, and like I said, I will put a link below to my blog post where I go over my whole grocery plan for the week. Let me know in the comments if you guys like seeing grocery hauls and meal plans together. Um, I kind of stopped doing grocery hauls a while back because I just felt like they weren't super interesting, but then I get a lot of requests for them when I put up uh, those uh, stickers on Instagram. So let me know if you guys like seeing grocery hauls every now and then, and I will try to do them again more often.